Tight budgets have police departments on the lookout for savings and innovation. Eric Schultz found two police officers who came up with a little bit of both in the back of their paddy wagon. Officer Michael Marino is in the transportation business. Officer James Payton is in it with him. They each drive a patrol wagon, what's referred to as a paddy wagon. The officers knew it could get pretty bad back here on the very hot and very cold days, and they wanted to do something about it. Even if their passengers are people on their way to jail for doing bad things. Just like your mama, you know, taught you, you know, when you was a little kid, you know, your, your mom says, uh, you know, treat other people like you'd want to be treated. And they're quick to point out, not everyone who rides in here is a criminal. We'll pick up homeless people that have nowhere to go and a lot of their belongings will put them in the back and take them to shelters. Sometimes they take the mentally ill to a doctor or a hospital. This year they got new vans and they noticed the vents were round instead of oval. Wheels turned in their heads and they came up with this PVC pipe. Just like the plumbing in your house, just $17 at the hardware store. But the owner wouldn't take any money. He said, well, here, you know, you can just take it. You know, he cut it for us. When they came back for more, they did pay. With a little duct tape, it fits perfectly in the vent and blows hot or cold air to the back of the wagon. They say it made a big difference in the summer. I'd open the door after the ride downtown, and I'd ask him how did it feel back there. No one was happy about going to jail, but no one complained about the heat either. Eric Schultz, NBC Action News. Now, both officers credit KCPD's fleet operations for approving their idea. Plans call for new vans to have fans installed on the bulkhead, while older vans will be retrofitted for those fans.